Hello, Further Meerkat here. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Mother 3. And this is the final episode. No, uh, no alarms this time to tell me when the episode's been going on for long enough. I'm just going to play through to the end of the game. Now, with this battle you just have to survive for X amount of time. That's it. Don't bother putting any shields up because uh, he gets rid of them anyway. I am hoping that I don't attack any, but that's useless. There's no point in using defense up, but I'm going to uh, offense up, but I'm going to use defense up. And um, after that, I would suggest just leaving the character. I'm going to try this and see if I survive. If not, I can redo it with me doing things differently. I'm going to try guarding, which as you can see makes my health decrease at a slower rate. And I'm going to hope that uh, I can manage to heal myself in time. Yeah, he's going to keep on doing that, and he gets two attacks per turn. I think I can let it drop down a little bit further. Now would be the time to stop letting it go back a little bit further. See, it didn't do as much harm then. This fight is very reminiscent of the fight against uh, Asbrel, Dreamer from um, Undertale. I know that the uh, Marvel series was a big um, influence on uh, Toby Fox, so that does make sense. Make sure if you have a magic pudding or something. Before this fight happens, if you get ninety percent of the way through this, you die and you're still dead. I might just wait until it gets up to full again, actually. I don't know whether to cut that bit out or not, but it's gonna take a while. That did take a while, but there we go. He starts doing less damage at this point. I like the way that the background plan for him changes as well. It 
can get the rhythm of the battle for Mask Man fights, but it's very difficult. And of course, since he doesn't have a heartbeat, uh, as we've uh, learned from the unpronounceable names, there's no way to. Hypnotize him and then use that to slow the rhythm down. I don't want to overuse these life arts, but. So don't want you end up using too much magic power. I might show off the entire fight or almost the entire fight anyway, apart from the bit I've already cut out. Just a father's love. Let me change the music as well. Thanks, Mike. That's really appreciated. go for longer than this for longer than This is not a great time to interrupt. I mean, I appreciate what you're doing, Sarah. I suspect is who it is, but I was about to increase my health. I'm going to let his, uh, okay, but, no, I'm going to let his health go up again. There's a certain bit of the battle where I'm hoping it will still allow me to do things, but there's a possibility it won't.
doing PK films. Hey, now he's uh, he's starting to give in. He could be using more powerful attacks than this. Or one more, and he was using more powerful attacks than this. This only requires He is way too powerful by the way, no matter what level you are at for you to destroy him. So there's no point in attacking. I have noticed the sunflower, like the sunflowers uh, I went through earlier when he was remembering stuff about his mum. I'm hoping it will make me give my thought. I thought at this point that it might not. Okay, now he's doing weaker attacks. I think she's starting to get through to him. All you have to do is survive this bit. Now, the last time I tried to record this episode, I didn't survive this bit. Unfortunately, I still have enough BP left to bring my health back up. Which 
sure why it's not called the Masked Boy. I suppose it's possible he's 18, but... I thought, even though it was three years, that he started being... that he was a lot younger than... 15, when the game started. I can't believe it took me that long to work out what 18 points for is. You do realise Aiden isn't actually attacking, right? I'm not fighting him. This fight hasn't been boring for you, but I felt it was worth showing it off pretty much. Yeah, so am I. Sorry, does give me a minute. Yeah, he 
Damn. Just so I go there when he uh, tried to find Jericho. And so I this is the reason why all of this happened. Sorry if you heard me blowing my nose there. I think Brian thought he had to do it because might be his last chance before his mind got clouded again and he started trying to kill Aiden again. Sad trying to escape, saying he is still alive. We never actually get to see the dragon, but some people don't. Dragon. So, in theory, since it was Aiden, 
the dragon should have protected everyone because there was goodness in his heart, but some fans have said no, they think the Nowhere Islands were destroyed. I'm not really sure on that one. Well, I guess that's it then. Um, I thought there would be uh, credits at the end, but there aren't. So, uh, yeah, that's uh, Mother 3. And um, I suppose I will see you in the next. Let's bye.